the stronger the hierarchy structure is, the more that it creates permissiveness within the um, association. Those on top, when they control enough power that their thoughts override the supposed rules, because when they speak to those below them, they will never be questioned and never be tested if they are following the rules. So, as a hierarchy structure crystallizes and hardens, it creates these patterns that are antithetical to human life because within that flow when you allow that permissiveness and the one-way negativity that it creates, it, it doesn't allow negative consequences to be evenly shared within the society. It concentrates them in one area and the structure has a hard time changing because that negativity is seen as unimportant even though it's structural. So in the end, the entire structure collapses in many different ways. And because people have a nat natural tendency to keep doing the same thing and wanting to do the same thing, generally when the structure collapses, it hurts those who are most vulnerable and leaves those who are able to repair the structure and continuate what it's doing and that's why hierarchies are so hard to destroy because they're self-replicating and we need to really realize that that they create a social structure that by its by the way it funnels negativity to one area rather than distributing it equally so that the negativity can be seen by all and dealt with structurally it creates weakness within the structure that fractures it and causes all kinds of social chaos and destruction.